Hey, what's going on guys? It's Pat and welcome back to Evil Minecraft. And today we are going to be fighting the Wither. I did a ton of stuff off camera, like all the boring stuff. Tried to keep the series as entertaining as possible. And I actually got all the stuff we need to fight him, which is awesome. And I killed like a thousand cows, you know, to make these bookcases right here. So I can enchant my bow, which I'm going to do right now. I'm kind of excited about it. So I'm hoping for something really good. And I don't know about you guys, but since I can't read this, I always feel like I gotta go with something longer. Like, it'll be a better enchantment. I don't know why. I know it doesn't mean anything, but... Oh! It's a long one right there. It's gonna be a great enchantment. I can feel it. Here we go. Come on, Pat. Power 4. Whatever. You know, Power 4 isn't bad. It's strong. I would have liked a couple other things on it, too, but I'll take that. Not too bad. Um, But yeah, I killed a lot of cows, and I have a lot of food. I'm just gonna grab this. Some steaks. Why not? Yeah, there was a lot of dead cows. I had to kill them. They were near the village, at least. So, also, I did get this chest plate, you know, from my spawner. Could not get pants. Really wanted them, because if I got both, then I could spend the diamonds we got on a new sword and enchant that, too. Which probably would have been nice, but um, I'll take this. It's got projectile, too, on it. Could be better, but we will take that. And I'll grab these seven diamonds, turn them into pants, since we're going to need, you know, some better pants anyway. And there we go. And we have two levels of enchantment left, so I guess we can enchant them, right? I think we need to put down some torches, though. You know, lower the level of it a bit here. Let me try now. All right, there we go. And protection one. Probably the best they could expect, I guess. All right, I'll take off the iron ones. Put on the diamond. Get rid of these torches. Makes it look ugly. And yeah, we're going to be fighting a boss today. I felt like I had to do all the boring stuff. I mean, it would have taken a couple hours of work to actually get all this stuff. Especially the wither skeleton skulls take forever. And it, it makes me sick. It takes so long. But yeah, what we should do is probably make some golden apples. Why not? Some normal golden apples. Alright, so I'll turn that into those. And, you know, I'll spread the little gold tears around it. They kind of look like tears, don't they? Alright, that should be good. And my apples right there. Golden apples. And yeah, I got a lot of potions of regeneration. I killed some gas. It was it was pretty easy for that stuff. It was really the skeleton skulls that took forever. Like, like way too freaking long. But I have everything now. And I'm, I'm happy... And I'm ready to fight a boss. If I die, I'm going to be sad, though. Because it took a lot of work to get everything set up for today's episode. Anything else I'm missing? Making sure. I have full diamond armor on. I've got, um, apples. We should actually organize our inventory. Probably not going to need the particle glove. Alright, so not the torches. Let me see here. Put the bow right there. I'm thinking maybe the apples, like, right next to us. With regeneration 2. I have a couple regeneration 2s I went with because I thought they might be more useful. I didn't go with all of them. I went with three, and I went with, like, mostly normal regeneration. We'll see, though. I, this this may kill me. All right, so, um, we're not going to fight him up here because I don't want to ruin the land. I think there's a piece of dirt on top of the border. Yeah, from the tornadoes, there's, like, leaves around and stuff. Kind of made a mess of our area here. So what I want to do, I think, is head down. All right, let's see. We'll head over here and see if there's, like, a nice spot for this fight. Yeah, maybe down there. And I was also thinking maybe trying to make some kind of cover. I don't know if it's going to work or not, though. I mean, I've not fought the Wither too many times in vanilla. Actually, only once, and it was my first series ever. The only time I ever fought the Wither in vanilla Minecraft. And I remember, like, it was an embarrassing fight. Like, I lost my weapon, and I was killing him with a pickaxe. He died, but it was... And I did it in my house. Don't ever fight the Wither in your house. Really bad idea. Really, really, really bad idea. All right, so what? There's a sheep on the tree. I don't know why I find that funny. They're always on trees. But I'm thinking maybe try to make some kind of cover out of this. Something we that was kind of low, but I don't think it really matters. Did you just eat the grass? Don't do that. Actually, I'm gonna make it a little higher. So I'm gonna make some kind of cover here that I could run under to protect myself from the wither. I just feel like it's gonna be such a hard fight. You just go back on the tree. You love the tree, don't you? It's going to get destroyed. You're probably going to die, to be honest with you. But yeah, some kind of cover might be really useful for the fight. You're going the wrong way. Don't don't go up there. Please don't go up there. Too dangerous. All right, so this might be helpful. I mean, the wither won't be able to hit me, Um, I'm thinking, if I'm under there. So I can just run under. Kind of safe here. I mean, about as safe as it can be. Let me try to extend it a little bit. Only have a little cobblestone left. Alright, so we'll see if this actually helps or not. Honestly, I'm not sure. But it's definitely worth a try. Anything to protect me from the wither. So if I spawn him over here and I run under there, it could be a good starting spot. Is what I'm thinking. 
And I'm going to throw regeneration on right away, because the wither effect is going to be painful. I know it is. So our first, well, actually our second boss fight of the series. The first one was extremely hard, but this one will be more annoying, because I have to, like, you know. I won't be able to fight it with nothing on. I need all my stuff. All right. Good luck, wither. You're going to need it. Just kidding. I'm probably going to need it. Okay. Regeneration. Probably should have the golden apples out. All right. So I got two minutes of that, and... I am gonna be ready for this. So yeah, he can't hit me from there. I wonder if I should have made a hole. I don't I don't know. Die! Knocks me back under. Yeah, but I can use the covering really well, probably. And try to get some like hits off like right on him. Like right to, Oh god, that's a big hole. Can I hit you from here? Yes. Oh no, my covering's breaking, but it's working pretty good. I'm getting lots of hits off before I'm taking too much damage here. It worked great until this second. I'm trying to back under it. Okay. Okay, calm down. Calm down here. Have a golden apple. No, we're doing pretty good. See, I'm worried about the wither effect. All right, it's wearing off. Let me get my health back up here. So if we play this smart, we can easily win is what I'm thinking. Please don't shoot anything at me. All right. So we should be right off the edge. Come on, wither. Come on. There he is. Might be able to hit him from here. Got him. All right, we got to play this smart like this. And we can take him down without getting killed, probably. All right, we've almost got him down to the ground already, actually. I need to, I need to hide under my cover. Okay. All right, we're good. We should be able to get him down to the ground right after this. All right, it's about to wear off. All right. I'll throw this back on. Okay, here we go. All right, Wither, you will die now. Come down to the ground. All right, he's down. Down to the diamond sword. Finish him off. We need to take him here. This is intense. Oh my god. We're gonna kill the weather, maybe. Maybe. Oh god, regeneration two. Need it. Need it right now. Oh, this is gonna be close. I got the regeneration two on. We got 22 seconds to kill him. Die, wither. Okay, we did it. We killed the wither. That's right. It is done. Oh man, that was tough. That was really hard. Luckily, I did all that prep work, or there's no way we would have been able to kill him. And we got our nether star. Very cool. Very cool. I am so happy about that. And we didn't wreck our home like the first series I ever did. Totally destroyed my house. It was embarrassing. I didn't know. I had no idea. I'd never fought him before. But yeah, now we'll always remember this. Okay, so what we're going to do is head back up. I do want to get a pet. I might be, like, too far away. Because I really wanted to grab the, you know, the wolf. I don't know if I'm going to do it today. I'll probably just do it next episode. Because, you know, I can actually, like, leave my house. It's kind of far away is the problem. But I really wanted to fight the wither today, which I felt was a little more important. But what we're going to do is head into the nether. Because there were so many requests for it. For a fire tornado. Everyone was like, please, head into the nether for the fire tornado. And I'm going to do it. But I got to put all my stuff down. Because I'm probably going to end up dying. So hopefully we'll have some, you know, good luck there. We'll see what happens. I'll try to go away from the portal so I don't, like, you know, destroy it or anything like that. Not sure if it can. I, I really don't know. Because I've not tested that. But we will find out. Or at least if it puts it out, that would be bad too. I should bring some flint and steel. Alright. So it's almost nighttime, actually. And we have a lot of stuff to put down. I think I need more wood. I need another chest. Hold on a second here. Alright, my axe is right here. See, I'm going to chop down another tree and get us some wood. Alright, which one should I chop? I'll just chop one of the small ones down. I don't want to waste too much time, like, chopping one of the giant trees. Alright, there we go. Awesome. So, yeah, it's almost nighttime. We actually killed the wither. That is sick. Can't believe we did it. I was a little nervous. I thought we might die during the fight because that was freaking hard. It really was. It was a challenge in this series. Okay, so here we go. We're going to make ourselves another chest. We should make two. Just make it a double chest. Why not? All right, awesome. Where should I put it, though? I can put it on this side. I have plenty of room down here, kind of. But not really. Is it nighttime yet? Go to bed. Nope. Not nighttime yet. So I'm going to put down all this stuff. I mean, not going to need it right now. And I could die in there. And that's kind of why I'm nervous. I do have another tornado gun left over. From last time. Okay. So yeah. We only have three levels of experience this time. And last time I actually died with my enchantment levels. But you know I had a lot of stuff to kill for today's episode anyway. So I got plenty back. 
And there's my tornado gun. I kind of want to go to bed first. Yeah, let's go to sleep. Like, I need some rest. I just killed the wither. It was dangerous. So, yeah, we'll take a look at a fire tornado. Maybe I should bring a little food. A little bit. I mean, I have some, you know. I have some right here. I'll bring three steaks. Okay, that was the wrong thing to do, Pat. One, two, three. Put these in chest. Okay, so we'll head in there. We're going to start one and see what it looks like. I haven't tried this. It's not been tested. But I figured, why not give it a go? Alright, please, no rare, you know, zombie pigman, because that'd be really annoying to die from one. Alright, so, I believe the way down is here. I think so. I think there was a couple ways, because one of the ways is when I went mining, to actually, like, get the stuff for the spawner. Yeah, this is the right way. Alright, so if I die, it's not a big deal, since we'll just spawn back at the house anyway. I'm kind of expecting death. I'm probably going to get sucked up and, like, thrown into the lava or something. Alright. So I'm going to do it like right next to the lava and kind of hope that it goes in. And hopefully it even works. Why does it look darker in here than usual? It feels kind of dark. Alright. So zombie pigman, you're all normal, which is good. They are aggressive if they are a rare spawn. Which does happen quite often, so you got to be careful. So I'm thinking to do it like right here. Hello. Alright. So I want to get behind. I don't want to get pulled in. It's like a big concern. All right, there we go. I'm not getting pulled in. This is good. All right. Oh God. Oh no. Okay, I'm I'm I'm, I'm surviving. I'm pulling myself back. This is gonna be so sick. <laughs> the zombie big men are getting pulled in, and yeah, it'd be bad because the lava's down there. And oh no. Oh no, it's pulling me. It doesn't actually have lava in it. Damn. I was really hoping it would. Shouldn't. Don't jump in this situation. Just hold yourself back like I am right now. Yeah, there is no fire in it. I thought that would make the fire tornado. And I'm pretty sure everyone else thought that too. Still, it's a tornado in the nether. How cool is that? And now like fire's like falling down. Interesting. All right, so I'm thinking we should just jump into it. Would that be stupid? Probably. I might end up in the lava. That's my concern. Like I'll try to jump and I'll just land straight in the lava and die. That's not what I wanted to do. You know what? Let's start a second one. And I'll just jump into that one. And we'll just die and get out of here. So that we get like a cool look of what happens like when you get sucked into one in the nether. Alright, here we go. This might lag. It almost always lags when there's, you know, multiple tornadoes. Come on, pull me into something. Did it even make a second one? Or it's like um forming now. I cannot tell. This place is so scary. All right, come on. Another tornado. Just pull me in. There we go. It looks like it's kind of just sucking towards the other one. Or it's like above there. I don't really know. Yeah, I thought it'd be cooler to have one in here. Let's do one on land. And see what happens. It doesn't seem to be moving either. It's kind of just like stuck there. All right, tornado gun. You need to do something epic right now. All right, guys. I think we're far enough away now. I'm just going to spawn one in right here. And let it pull me in if possible. I don't know if this is going to work. It doesn't... Okay, here we go. Yeah. Pull me into that. Don't throw me in the lava. All right, here... I saw, like, a rare spawn right there. He's probably gonna kill me. I want to get pulled into this. Look how weird it looks in the nether. My portal's right over there. I'm sure we'll be fine. I'm sure the portal will be fine, too. Either way, we're gonna end up back in the normal world, I'd imagine. There's, like, lava blocks, like, forming in it. It doesn't even know what to do with me. There's no sky, and that's why it's so weird. Oh, man, we are actually getting pulled over the lava. That's kind of what I wanted, though, right? Cool. Oh, no. Oh, that was not expected. All right. So, yeah, I died. We kind of thought that might happen. Anyways, guys, I figured I'd try that out and see what happens. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.